we get the camera rotator itself, another adapter plate. We have cables. I would say this is about a meter, about three feet long. And then we have a quick start guide. Let's take a look at the rotator itself. Anodized aluminum body. We can see down here they have markings showing the scope and camera size so we know which way it goes. The scope side here has a M54 thread on it and that is of course the fixed size. This is the non-rotating side. The other side here comes default with this plate which is also M54 but we got this here so you have the option to unscrew these six screws put this in instead, and this converts the camera side from M54 down to an M48 thread. This side here, we have a USB-C. This is, of course, where our USB-C cable goes. And then there is a HC port. This is for the hand controller. If you want to adjust this manually, this tiny little hole here on the telescope side of it is a lock, basically. So you could put a hex key in here, and that will basically lock the rotation of it so that if you have an adapter on here, you can't get off. You can lock the rotation, get the adapter off, and then remove the key then it can once again to spin freely. That's a nice little addition, I think. 